you're in the Amazon. Of course you're not, but picture it. You're staring at the endless, deceptive, treacherous even, skies of the Amazon. You just might be able to see the beautiful yet elusive Harpy Eagle. But how? How does this eagle, tiny in comparison to the Amazon, protect it? You're watching Geofacts, a channel that hopes to bring awareness about endangered species and sometimes about geography. If you want to journey into the wilderness with me, you can start now by subscribing. Okay, so back to the question. How does this eagle protect and keep the Amazon alive? Let's not wait any further and answer that question. The harpy eagle, along with the jaguar and anaconda, are apex predators, which means they themselves have no natural predators. To look at how the harpy eagle saves or protects the Amazon forest, first we have to look into the Amazon food chain. As with any food chain, the Amazon forest has three parts of the food chain. The predators, the prey, and the food. Something peculiar about the Amazon food chain is that it doesn't stop at those three primary levels. The predator-prey relationship in the Amazon is very complicated. With many ups and downs, twists and turns, it isn't just a pyramid, it is in fact a whole web and you might get tangled in it if you try and separate the predators from the prey. But in the Amazon food chain, the harpy eagle sits at the top, perches at the top. The harpy eagle preys on arboreal animals, animals that live on trees. What better example to this than the capuchin monkey? The capuchin monkey is a monkey native to South America, especially the rainforests. This monkey is extremely agile and um, acrobatic, one could say. They've co-evolved with the Amazon. They've learned to adapt to the rich and dense forests of the Amazon. So the harpy eagle does have a very impressive matchup. But to deal with this, they need to put up their game. And they have. Their vision? On point. They can see something two centimeters from as far as 200 meters away. Their hearing isn't exceptional, but it is better than average. They can hear a rustle of leaves in a rainforest, and that is better than good. They sometimes have claws bigger than grizzly bears, and this is important, especially when you compare the size of a grizzly bear and a harpy eagle. These claws are very important to harpy eagles because they need to snatch monkeys, huge monkeys, from the branches of trees or from vines. They have incredible flight power. As all eagles do, they can navigate through the dense Amazon rainforest. So the capuchin monkey does have an incredible yet hard to escape predator. By the way, if you are enjoying the video, please don't forget to leave a like. I also hope I've earned your subscription. So how does the harpy eagle protect the Amazon? Well, the three apex predators, the predators that don't have predators, as I mentioned before, are the jaguar, anaconda, and harpy eagle. The harpy eagle is more important than the rest because most of the Amazon are trees and the harpy eagle hunts arboreal animals. Loosely translating to Harpy eagles eat animals that live in trees, which means most Amazonian animals. Of course, the jaguar and anaconda do come in play, but we're talking about the harpy eagle. Taking it out would mean smaller predators like monkeys will thrive. These small predators will eliminate or at least reduce the insect population or whatever they eat to a low number and that creates an imbalance so bad that the Amazon starts to collapse. But that's not it. If the Amazon starts to collapse, we lose a lot of oxygen, 
almost 20% of the world's oxygen comes from the Amazon. And a huge portion of the carbon dioxide produced by our world is absorbed by it. If that's not enough, several species will go extinct. That's why we should protect the harpy eagle, which by the way is listed in least concern. There's only 50,000 to 60,000 remaining in the wild. The harpy eagle is known as an umbrella species. Why do you think so? Comment down below. If you like this video and want more content like this, make sure to subscribe. And be sure to comment down below what you think about the harpy eagle. Check the links in the description for more information. And if you like this video and still aren't sure about subscribing, be sure to check out why you should subscribe to my channel. Enjoy your day!